Usually we have a curiosity to know what's inside our gadget especially when it comes to our mobile phone we really want to know what inside our mobile and how it made Today I'm going to show what are the process that involved in manufacturing of mobile phones This is Itel manufacturing unit before going inside you have to go through lots of safety measures It's not easy to enter factory like this we got a special permission to visit this factory Before entering you need to wear overcoat head and foot cover Then you need to move to a chamber which blows high pressure air on you to remove minute dust particles on you. Finally, we entered into SMT section. Manufacturing of motherboard starts here. The machinery was huge. Definitely, I was amazed with this experience. The printed circuit board PCB is the starting part of the whole manufacturing process. Once they fit all the necessary components in the PCB, finally you will get complete motherboard for a mobile. When you look at the process you can see at a time they are making four PCBs in order to reduce the processing and manufacturing time the initial process starts manually they arrange all the PCBs on these plates and they'll place it inside a machine then the machine automatically picks and load it on the inside then it applies a paste on top and it starts to analyze and it give final result whether the board is in good condition or not next it go through a long automatic process where it fits all the diodes and chips initially it fits all the basic diodes then it fits the processor and storage unit finally it fits the sim and sd card slots then later it enter into another machine where the board is maintained for the temperature of 250 degrees celsius for some time and finally it comes out then once again machine is checking whether everything is fitted perfectly also they check manually again for the confirmation now using a laser machine they cut into four separate motherboards After cutting the motherboards once again they do manual quality checking on the lab to see everything fits perfectly next we are moving to the assembly section in assembly section we are going to see how they are fitting components like mic speaker camera into the motherboard and make a complete mobile until now we seen lots of automation process hereafter we are going to see lots of manual process The first step on the assembly line they are taking out the display and removing stickers on the back side and checking the display quality once next they attach the display to a pouch make sure it's not damaged on the process then they are attaching the apps on the top then they are preparing the circuit which going to connect display and motherboard then they are inserting volume and power button on the side the pcb which we saw earlier is for different mobile in assembly line the motherboard which we are seeing is for different mobile They scan each motherboard and take the report. Then they attach camera module to the motherboard. It's a press type module. In future, if there isn't any issue, it's easy to replace. Then they are attaching the antenna to the motherboard. The motherboard is the heart of a mobile. Now they are connecting the heart to the display and they are doing it manually. Other than motherboard, there is one more small PCB. They are soldering mic, charging port, everything to that PCB. After that, they are sticking a small white color sticker. so it will help them to find out the phone is water damaged during the service the sticker will turn into red if it's water damage then they are testing the charging port to make sure it works perfectly this is the frame for closing the motherboard on the back side you can see the camera holes is also there also they are attaching the bottom plastic frame finally they are attaching the battery since it's a non removable battery they are attaching a metal frame on the top The motherboard panel and camera fixing area are fully covered with air proof to maintain the humidity level. After the long manual process, once again automation work starts again. Machine screw all the remaining screws. Before we use the mobile, they are using it once for testing purpose to make sure SIM card everything works perfectly. They are adding a small frame and doing a small drop test. After they check the display and the camera quality, they are checking display multicolor on the dark room. They are checking headphones, flashlight and OTG cable. Once they finish all the manual checking they remove the sim card and put the back panel initially we thought they are putting a broken back panel later we comes to know that it's a temporary panel they are putting this panel for next testing not only checking manually in the small machine they are inserting the phone it checks everything and make sure internally everything is perfect then they are inserting the mobile into a vibrating machine to make sure there is no loose connections Once the process is completed they connect all the mobile with charger if any mobile is not passing the vibration test then it won't charge so they can easily find out faulty mobile still they didn't fit the back panel yet once again they are testing the display and touch everything until the test what you saw all mobile has to go through this process hereafter the test you are going to see 
they'll take randomly 10 to 15 mobiles from each batch and they'll do various kind of drop test with both machine and manually once all this test is completed finally mobile goes for packing the sticker you usually see on the new phone is pasted here only finally the box packing area they are inspecting the box for damages then they are sticking imei stickers on both phone and the box to make sure imei is correct they are scanning through barcode scanner and check whether it's pass or not finally they cover the mobile with back cover they are putting everything inside the box and measure weight on the weighing machine generally if everything is there inside the box there will be a certain weight they make sure that weight is there they seal the box and put it inside a wrapper and seal it after they trim four corners of a wrapper kept inside a machine finally it comes with neat packaging if some packaging is not perfect then they are using heat blower to make it perfect finally you'll get a mobile phone with a complete packaging i hope today's video is helpful for you see you on another video until then this is karthik signing off please like share and do subscribe to our channel